The War of the Currents and the Electric Chair. In the late 1800s, a fierce battle raged over the future of electricity. Thomas Edison championed direct current, or DC, which sent electricity in one continuous direction, but was inefficient over long distances. Nikola Tesla and George Westinghouse promoted alternating current, a system where the flow of electricity reversed direction many times per second, making it far better for transmitting power across cities. Edison, fearing he would lose his grip on the industry, launched a brutal smear campaign. He publicly electrocuted animals, from dogs to an elephant, using his rival system to highlight its dangers. But he didn't stop there. He secretly backed the development of the electric chair, ensuring it ran on the same technology. In 1890, the first execution of a man named William Kemmler was botched, gruesome, and slow. Edison wanted the public to associate his competitor's system with death. Despite his efforts, alternating current proved superior. It powered the 1893 Chicago World's Fair and later the Niagara Falls power plant, securing its place as the foundation of modern electricity. Today, our homes and cities run on Tesla's vision while Edison's campaign remains a dark chapter in electrical history. Follow for daily videos.